Greetings, unsettled souls. <laughs> Listening to the You Are an Idiot song, and you are. You know what's coming. The Dumdy of the Day. And of course, my God, who else could it be? Our, our Dumdy in chief. Uh, Biden snaps when asked about Afghans falling from airplanes and insists he made no mistakes. Joe Biden sat down with ABC News' George Stephanopoulos on Wednesday to explain his disastrous handling of the military's pullout from Afghanistan. When you look at what's happened over the last week, was it a failure of intelligence, planning, execution, or judgment, Stephanopoulos asked Biden. Biden, it says, insisted that he made no mistakes in his execution of the botched U.S. military withdrawal, and that the Afghanistan's president and army were to blame for the Taliban's quick takeover. Right, part of that is true. Right, part of that is true. The Afghanis, Afghanis, Afghanistan, uh, their army did not stand up. And I've heard people say that they didn't have the weaponry. If they had 20 years worth of weaponry, the Taliban has it, so they had the weaponry. Listen to this idiot. When you look at what's happened over the last week, was it a failure of intelligence, planning, execution, or judgment? Look, I don't think it was a failure. Look, it was a simple choice, George. When the, when the Taliban... Uh, I'm amazed you remember that he was talking to George. Let me back up and put it another way. When you had the government... Look at the blinking. ...of Afghanistan, the leader of that government getting in a plane and taking off and going to another country. When you saw the significant collapse of the of the uh, Afghan troops we had trained, over, up to 300,000 of them, just leaving their equipment and, and, and taking off, that was, you know, I'm not, th 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 that's what happened. Yeah, that's what <laughs> Shazam, Sparky! But we've all seen the pictures. We've all seen those hundreds of people packed into a C-17 We've seen Afghans falling, Stephanopoulos said, referring to the harrowing footage of people evacuating military planes falling from the sky over the weekend. That was four or five days ago, Biden snapped. Weird flex, but really? Listen to this idiot. That's like saying, well, it's only four or five days ago, so it doesn't matter. I mean, we failed four or five days ago. We're winning now. We are? We're doing worse now than we were then. Four or five days ago. Like it was a million years ago. What an idiot. That's simply what happened. But we've all seen the pictures. We've seen those hundreds of people packed into a C-17. We've seen Afghans falling. That was four days ago, five days ago. What did you think when you first saw those pictures? What I thought was we're, we have to gain control of this. They have not gained control of it. And what damn difference does it make if it was four or five days ago? That means it just happened, you idiot! What the hell is he talking about? The other thing, is, and it still amazes me that nobody talks about this, he got off of a plane about a month ago, three weeks ago, and said, my book's been wiped. And nobody will address what the hell he was talking about. Nobody! Did he mean I'm tired? Oh man, my book's been wiped. How does the leader of the free world, even in a nation as stupid as we are, even in a nation that thinks that someone like Beyonce can sing, even in such a stupid nation, how does this not get people asking questions? How did that whole exchange just get swept under the carpet less than a day later and nobody ever asked him what the hell he meant by my butt's been wiped? How? We have to move this more quickly. We have to move in a way in which we can take control of that airport. Well, we haven't done that, have we there, King Joe? I mean... He says, you don't think it could have been handled, this exit could have been handled better. And Biden said, no, I don't think it could have been handled in a any other way than that, we're going to go back in hindsight and look, but the idea that somehow there's a way to have gotten out without chaos ensuing, I don't know how that happens. I don't know how that happened. Right, it didn't happen. What do you mean you don't know how it happened? 
It didn't happen. What you meant to say is you don't know how that would have happened. But you can't say that because you're losing your mind. And we did. So you don't think this could have been handled? This actually could have been handled better in any way? No mistakes? No, I, I, I don't think it could have been handled in a way that there, we, we're going to go back in hindsight and look. But the idea that somehow there's a way to have gotten out without chaos ensuing, I don't know how that happened. I don't know how that happened. So for you, that was always priced into the... It didn't computer. happen. I don't know how that happened. Just a month ago, Biden claimed that the likelihood that there's going to be the Taliban overrunning everything and owning the whole country is highly unlikely. People were falling from the planes, Mr. President. That was four or five days ago, Jack. This is our leadership, friends. This is our leadership. Trump bad. Orange man bad, yeah? Let me show you a whole lot worse, friends. Four or five days ago. Yeah, twit! Good night, friends. God bless.